Good evening and welcome to my story time with Miss Debbie. Before children, we get started. Remember, we sit crisscross applesauce, we take out our ears, we put them on our face, and we listen to Miss Debbie's story. If you have any questions, we raise a quiet hand and Miss Debbie will choose you when we can. So I want to start off by showing you the little props that we have in order to tell the story since this story is all about friends. So we have two friends that are gonna share a toy. So during the story, we will use these friends in order to show what sharing and caring is. We also wanna bring in Larry, Larry the puppet. And she is here and she helps tell the story. She loves to share, right Larry? You love to share? Yes, you wanna give Miss Debbie a hug. Oh, she is so sweet. She loves to give us hugs and kisses, and she wants to be friends. So we are going to start our book today by the cover. Can anybody tell me what they predict in this story? Yes, you see two friends hugging. Yes, they must love each other. What else can you predict from this story? Yes, maybe they are sharing. So there are a lot of predictions to our story. Let's go inside and see what the story is about. So we have this beautiful picture, right, Lara? Lara's gonna help tell the story. And this is a beautiful picture of a school. And let's see what the school reads. It was my first day of preschool, and boy, was I scared. I didn't know anyone, and the building was oh so big. I asked my mommy if I can bring my favorite toy to school, but she said preschool was for big kids, and there were so many toys I can use. I would be able to choose from these toys. So he wanted to bring his toys to school, but because school has a lot of toys, right, Larry? Yes, we don't bring our home toys here to school. Let's see what's going on in this picture. Can anybody tell me? Yes, it looks like they're making friends. What do you think, Larry? Do you think they're making friends? Yes, she thinks they're making friends too. I got out of the car with my mom and she walked me to the door. When the door opened, there were all children playing together. I said to myself, oh no, they all made friends and now I, have, I will not have any. So what did she, he think? He said, look at all these children playing together. Maybe I'm not going to have any friends. Do you think that's true? Right. No, I don't think it's true either. As my mommy kissed me goodbye, she said to join the group and say, hi, my name is Jesse. Let's be friends. Lara, hi, my name is Miss Debbie. Can we be friends? And is your name Lara? Yes. Oh, thank you. So next we have a picture of a friend. And what does that friend have in her hands? Yes, a puppet like Miss Debbie. As I was looking around the room, my teacher came and said hello. So it's not a friend, it's the teacher. My name is Miss Sam and this is Layla. You must be Jessie. I said yes, I am Jessie. As Layla was in Miss Sam's hands, she reached out for me. And Layla spoke, she said to me, Let's be friends, just like mommy say, all the children would say. So did that, you think that made Jesse feel comfortable? Yes, why do you think that? Right, because somebody said the words that mommy said, let's be friends. So now this is a big what? Yes, a circle. It was circle time. Miss Sam put Layla in the center of the circle. I was wondering why we should be part of our circle. Hmm. Let's see, Miss Sam started to tell us that Layla was going to show us how to share. So let's get our two little bears. Okay, we have our two little bears and we're gonna use these bears to share. So what are they gonna share? Yes, they're gonna share this toy. So when it's your turn to share, you guys will share the toy and be friends. Do we fight over toys? No, we wait our turn. Good job. After circle time, I found a friend. Her name was Anna. She came over to me while I was building, and I said, do you want to play? 
I said yes. Anya said, let's be friends. So is that what happened when the mom said? Yes, the mom said that children would ask to be friends. The bell rang for lunch. Oh no, who will I eat lunch with? Anya came over and asked if she can sit at my table. And she brought another friend, Mason. Mason said to me, hi, I'm Mason. Let's be friends. So in this picture, all the students are sitting together eating lunch and they all wanted to be friends. Later on, the bell rang again and it was recess time. I was so scared all morning that I would not have any friends. And there I was at recess with so many friends. Anya, Mason, then Ben and Abby came over. And last Mila and Mona came too. I couldn't wait to tell my mommy. So do you think what the mommy said is going on here? Everyone is trying to be good job, friends. And we are all friends in this classroom together. And we are going to learn and share. It was the end of her school day. Miss Sam said, what was our favorite part of the day? I quickly raised my hand and said, friends, using the words, let's be friends, was so exciting. And now I have so many. Who remembers the child's name? Yes, Jesse. He is our friend. Good job. I was so happy to see mommy when she picked me up. I told her all about my day and how her and Layla knew you had to say your name and let's be friends. And it worked, mommy. I have so many friends. So what did we learn today? We learned how to share and just to be friends with everybody and to just hug and, and share and play with our toys. That is what we learned today. We learned some new words and we all are going to be nice. And if, if you guys are, they, you both want a toy, what do you do? You want to tell me? Oh, Lara said, if you both want a toy, you come to the teacher and then we could put a timer and we can share that toy or if we want to play individually, we can too. Thank you, guys. Thank you for listening. Great job. Let's break up into small groups because Miss Debbie wants you to draw how you're going to make friends today. So Miss Debbie will put you in small groups and we will draw pictures and we will use our props to tell the story. And maybe Lara too because she wants to be all your friends. So let's listen for your name for your groups. <laughs>